I'm going to measure your biomechanics. Your wingspan relative to your height, the length of your forearm relative to your upper arm. I, I, what is your height? 69? 5'9? Yeah. yeah, I want to see what your wingspan is. I, I want to see what that is. If your wingspan exceeds your height more than 2 or 3 inches, you should have a little bit of a, more of an upright swing. And you don't have an upright swing. And if, you're, if your wingspan is shorter than your height, by, like mine's 2 inches shorter, you're gonna have me last time, and I was not. I was more of the same. You were the same. Yeah. So I couldn't. I have to look at my notes. I okay. have it in there. Gotcha. I don't know what's going on with this. Yeah, you're right in plane there. That's good. So the takeaway looks a little better. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit. I didn't really try to improve. The handle needs to stay in closer to the right thigh. Your hands go a little bit out off plane right there. Oh, I got you, yeah. That means you're you're breaking your wrist a little bit. You want to feel like your left wrist stays at the same angle. But it's a nice position at the top. I don't know why that's doing that.